each other with respect, to care and to listen to one another. But marriage is also a commitment between a husband and a wife to be not only each other's lover, but above all, most importantly, Elvis's lover. <laughs> no, best friends, throw off your years together. You two return face to face, hold hands three times. Yeah, <laughs> look, at, <laughs> look into each other's eyes while I sing a beautiful love song. <laughs> Once again, I take you once again to be my loving wife. To be my loving wife in good times and bad. In good times and bad. Mm -hmm. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. Mm -hmm. For richer, for poor. For richer, for poorer. For now and forever. For now and forever. Ah. <laughs> nice. Nice. And as you look into Christopher's eyes, tell him, I take you once again. I take you once again. To be my loving husband. To be my loving husband. In good times and bad. In good times and bad. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. For richer, for poor. For richer and poor. For now and forever. For now and forever. Well, here at the Grayson Chapel, we have some special vows. So, Christopher, tell her, I promise. I promise. To always love you tender. To always love you tender. And never leave you. I never leave you. At Heartbreak Hotel. At Heartbreak Hotel. I will never have. I will never have. A suspicious mind. A suspicious mind. <laughs> and from this day. And from this day. I promise to be. I promise to be. Your hunka hunka burning love. Your hunka hunka burning love. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Your turn on me to tell them I promise. I promise. To take you as my hunka hunka burning love. <laughs> And always love you tender. And always love you tender. And never return you to sender. And never return you to sender. I will never step. I will never step. On your blue suede shoes. On your blue suede shoes. Or treat you. Or treat you. Like a hound dog. Like a hound dog. For you will always be. For you will always be. My loving teddy bear. My loving teddy bear. Wonderful guys. Well, let me just say, may your love always sustain you two in trying times. But make those happy times even more wonderful and fulfilling as the years go by. So on behalf of the grace of one chapel and the suit that I wear, <laughs> thank you very much. Once again, pronounce you husband and wife. Kiss your wife. Come on,
one more kiss. Give her a kiss. There you go. Help us. I've got the building. Right